This is part two. Uh, I forgot where we left off talking already. Um, I think we're at um, having my second surgery in April of 2008. Or after my MRI, I had I had my MRI that showed the bulging or the herniated discs and a stenosis that never got fixed from the first surgery. I had that done in August of 2007, an MRI. And workman's comp was denying me money, denying my medical treatment, and I, was, I didn't know about Illinois Public Aid at the time that I could have had that all along and my surgeon accepts it. So anyhow, I wait in pain from um, August, well basically since oh, two th 10 of 2006 until April, I think we went over this in the last one, until April of um, 2000 eight is when I had my real surgery that I should have had back in 10 of 2006 which I could have had if I knew about the public aid assistance here in Illinois but it was a workman's comp case I did have insurance at the time because it was a new job I was a truck driver. I still had Teamsters insurance uh, left. And when I called them up and told them what happened, they says, don't even bother to continue with Cobra because your injury was at work. Your workman's comp is responsible. We are not going to pay anything. So anyways I, I I had to sell my house luckily I broke even my truck got repossessed and my Harley Davidson got repossessed and I had no income for probably over a year I don't know how the heck I survived but now I'm sitting in a trailer home that my grandma owns and luckily she moved out to a nurse, not a nursing home, but an old folks senior living uh, apartment building. And uh, that seemed to work out just great. At least I got somewhere to live. Not everybody is would be as lucky as I I have been I mean I'm making my story sound out terrible but there's people that are probably worse I'm sure there are I'd love to hear their stories um anyhow and, they, and, and another big thing was all oh, you're in so much pain because you weigh so much you're obese well, when I got hurt, I was 258 pounds. I'm six foot three. When I had my surgery, I was about uh, 320 pounds. I couldn't do anything. The only thing I had to look forward to were my pills and food because I was so much in pain I couldn't do anything and that's how I gained all the weight now since after the the this surgery here that I that's going on that I had in April I've since lost 70 pounds I'm almost down to the weight I was before uh, uh, before I gained weight well anyhow them telling me that weight, my weight is the pr issue 
it's not the it was never the issue and you can tell your own body it's hard for doctors to tell and, and diagnose back pain in my opinion um, because I knew all along that it was not a muscle problem it was not a strain muscle because my belly was so big because now I don't have such a big belly and it still hurts so that's my gripe I, I am going to see all of my doctors this month it's January of 2009 and I'm gonna get uh, I think it's a malogram or something done because I had an MRI done uh, last month and it came back okay they found nothing wrong with my L5 S1 um, but I I can feel it it's bone on bone is what I feel I don't feel any muscle I'm very I still am very weak but I don't feel any muscle problem I feel it's a bone on bone or something right in the center of my spine which I'm kind of wishing that a four level fusion would would have been great and I would have been taken care of but I don't know that's the doctors I just fell in you know whatever um, anyhow workman's comp up and down um, my lawyer doesn't know half the time what's going on with my case I don't think he cares um, I've talked to other lawyers and they're all in the same boat lawyers are gonna have their day in heaven <laughs> heaven they're gonna have their day when they die um and uh i i just want to uh, pulse this and see if anybody else i'm sure there's lots of people struggling right now like i am i am finally getting paid from workman's comp i finally got approved for social security disability i have other problems other than my back um I'm 31 years old collecting Social Security. I feel I feel ridiculous. I feel like I I'm useless. I've got severe depression, anxiety like you wouldn't believe. I've got I've had prostatitis now for 10 years. Nobody seems to be able to fix that. Um, my back pain. It, it is. This is one of my good days. Um, I don't get many of them. Y usually I can hardly... I've, I've been sleeping on my chair. I don't know if that's good or bad, but... I can at least sleep there. I got a lazy boy, so... But... Um, that's it. I've really been rambling on, and and if somebody has watched this whole whole thing, I greatly appreciate it, um, and would love uh, some feedback. Um, see, because I know a lot of people are going to workman's comp and have gotten hurt at work, cause or else they got you busting your ass is at work um, well, the majority of the time so um, yeah that's about it I'm uh, 31 years old I'm from Wakanda Illinois and um, this is what I'm going through and things have got I'm almost 
things are 100% better than they were last year.